it's the start of week, is this three or four? I'm not really sure. It's incredible. It's gone really fast. And today I'm just going to do a quick grocery haul. Some of this is the same. So, you know, I have my uh, romaine lettuce and a green leaf lettuce, red grapes. These, I, I'm not a huge fan of green grapes, but they have this whole thing on a reduced price for $1.25 and, oh no, $1.85. And I go through so much fruit right now that it was fully worth it. Same with the Granny Smith. I'm not a huge fan of Granny Smith apples. I prefer others, but they were $1.85 for six. So that's a score. I got some peaches. I got some lemons. I got grapefruit. I got one Honeycrisp apple. These are my favorite kind of apples. Oh, delicious. I got sweet potato. These are a white sweet potato on the outside and I can't wait to show you the inside. Avocado, same as usual. I got a bunch of them. I got strawberries. I'll tell you about those in a minute. Let me put a couple things aside to talk about. I got my usual yellow squash zucchini. These are great sides for me. I got some, I think they're Italian plums. They are delicious. They're just itty bitty and they are so sweet and they are great. I got a golden delicious apple, red and sweet onions, mangoes this week, regular sweet potatoes of course, broccoli, Brussels sprouts. I got an acorn squash, butternut squash. I don't know what I was saying, sorry. Uh, cabbage. And this is a K-O-R-U apple, Koro. I've just never had this kind of apple. And so I decided I was going to get one. And I have some cilantro. And then my meat for this week, this week I have shrimp, I have uh, ground turkey, I have chicken, and I have bacon. So let me talk to you about these. So I'm going to make pickles today or tomorrow. I don't know which. Anyways, making pickles. And I'm also making pickled okra because they were some great fresh okra and it looked delicious. So I'm gonna pickle okra as well. And then I'm making gummy bears out of this. I actually don't know what my molds are. They're like maybe hearts or gummy bears or bears or something. I don't remember what the molds are, but anyways, I'm gonna make gummies out of strawberries again, either today or tomorrow. And that is it for my grocery haul. I have a few other things that are just the same as usual. And otherwise, I look forward to checking in with you tomorrow. I'll probably check in with you before that. If I make these goodies at some point, I definitely will. All right, everyone. See you later. Bye. I'm checking in with Saturday's lunch. It's a salad, of course, because I don't like to cook, at least in the day on the weekends. I'm making some stuff, prepping for the week. I just don't want to be cooking as well. So my protein is tuna and I have some avocado on here, but I only put a little bit because I'm gonna have you having avocado um, tonight as well. And then uh, one of the Granny Smith apples and red onion and some olives, I think that was it. And then I made, this week I made uh, red wine vinaigrette just for something different. It's the same recipe, it's just red wine vinaigrette instead of balsamic. So um, red wine vinegar, olive oil, honey, garlic, and a little bit of salt, that's it. And then I'm gonna have some cantaloupe, and then I made um, some of the seltzer uh, flavored water, so it's plain seltzer. I just put in fresh lime juice and a little smidge of maple sugar, and it is delicious, and I'm gonna go eat. Bye everyone. Hello all, I am back with supper. I am having turkey burgers, there on top is AIP compliant bacon. Um, it's an Applegate brand <coughs> or Apple Farms or something like that. I can look it up if you're interested. I can uh, look at the package. And then some just sauteed onions. And these are sweet potato fries. They are purple sweet potatoes, so they look really burnt. Some of them are a little burnt, but I like them that way. But the reason that they're so dark is because um, they were purple sweet potatoes to begin with. And then I took a couple of olives. And then I made just a little bit of um, teriyaki sauce that I'm going to use on my burgers. And that is my supper. I am going to probably wait on the cooking and do that tomorrow. I have some other just errand type stuff that I want to get done. And I will see you later. Bye, everyone. 
Hey everybody, it's Sunday evening. I've got a lot done today. I fermented some okra, so that is in the making. I got that recipe from healthnutmama.com. So those will need, it said that it that you should really taste test it, but it needs to set for probably at least seven to 10 days in a dark, cool place. So I have that in my pantry. And then the other thing I can show you, I made gummies. So I made strawberry because strawberries were on sale. I made little star ones and I made little shells, little shell gummies. And then of course I had to make some little bears because I mean, you know, gummy bears, aren't those little cute? So this recipe I got from Restorative Cuisine. And then I did my meats for the week, cooked up some more chicken. I'm gonna make my hash in just a little bit. Wanted to talk to you about breakfast. I just ate my leftover turkey burger and a grapefruit. And then for lunch, I had a salad and some grapes and now I'm having my supper. So I have a little chicken skillets um, dish, some avocado with lemon and just a couple of olives. And then I'm gonna, for dessert, have these gummies that I pulled out. So the chicken dish, it's not really a recipe. It started out kind of a recipe, but basically I just put in a little bit of veggie broth to my pan and softened up some veggies. I have okra, carrots, Brussels sprouts, and apples. I know apples aren't veggies, but you know what I mean. And then when those were starting to get soft, I put in chicken, and then I added bacon at the last minute just to soften it up a little bit. And I added a little bit of my red wine vinaigrette just because. <laughs> Thought it sounded good. So that has been my day. I hope your day is going well. It's the start of a brand new week. So that's exciting. And I look forward to talking with you tomorrow. Bye, everyone. Hey, everybody. It's Tuesday night. Let me tell you about my day. So for breakfast, I had some prosciutto and some broccoli and a grapefruit. For lunch, I had some hash and uh what did I have? oh and a mango and then for supper I am having chicken alfredo on zucchini noodles so I can't have coconut and almost everything that's like saucy based like that is used uh, with like coconut or made with coconut from coconut cream or coconut milk so I made this what's called cauliflower cream it's basically just cauliflower cooked with chicken broth and a few other seasonings and then pureed. And it actually worked. So the recipe for the chicken Alfredo, if you want it, let me know because I don't remember the site that I used. But I mean, really it was just um, coconut cream, sorry, this as the coconut cream, or if you're not, susceptible to coconut you can use or you can use that and nutritional yeast which is like a cheese substitute garlic powder salt onion powder and I think that was it and then you took a cup of chicken broth and you mixed in arrowroot starch like as a thickener or arrowroot flour I used arrowroot starch because that's what I had and it worked just as well as a thickener and you then cooked it on medium heat for about 10, 15 minutes. Then down to low, you need to keep stirring because it will, you know, um, start sticking to the pan and it thickens up as thick as you want it to be. And you have Alfredo sauce and I tasted it and it is delicious. I'm very excited about it. I also have half an avocado with it and some olives and then I'm gonna have some grapes. I also wanted to tell you about some new supplements that I got. So these are whole food, multivitamin plus iron. They are specifically for gut health or unless I got the wrong thing. I'm looking at it because I thought that the one I got was specifically for gut health. I might have to send this back. Oh no. Wah, wah. All right, everyone, I'll have to look into it and I will let you know. Oh yeah, three strain probiotic. Yeah, plus iron because a lot of times with that, and especially since I'm not doing the organ meat, even with the supplements, I wanna make sure I get enough iron. So that is what I was looking for. Yay, so there it is. And I will talk to everybody later. Hope everybody's having a great week. Bye. Hey everybody.
everybody. Happy Wednesday. We are halfway through the week. Two more days. Hang in there. So let's start with breakfast. I had some prosciutto and a really large grapefruit. I remembered my fruit today. Woo! And then for lunch, I had the leftover chicken alfredo with zucchini noodles. It was not as good the next day. It was seriously delicious last night. And I'm I'm really excited that that cauliflower cream that I made is going to work in a lot of recipes as a replacement for coconut milk or coconut cream. So I'm very excited for that. And I will be doing many experiments coming up. So then, so I didn't eat much of that at all. Just, it just didn't, it just wasn't as good the next day. And then um, I had a big apple. So I am pretty hungry. I am having shrimp salad stuffed in an avocado so shrimp salad is just cut up shrimp wine juice salt cilantro and red onion to taste however much you want of each and then i also have a bag of these sweet potato chips so that is my day and i have some water that is my day. I would love to hear about your day. I hope your week is going great. Let me know if you've discovered any new recipes. I would love, love, love to try them because I'm always looking for new recipes. And I will check in with you guys tomorrow. Bye. Hey everybody, it's Thursday. Oh, one more day. It's Friday Eve. Oh, so excited. So for breakfast, I had, what did I have for breakfast? I had, oh, some prosciutto and a huge grapefruit again. And then for lunch, I had the leftover shrimp salad and what did I have with it? Oh, I had the rest of the other half of the bag of potato chips that I had last night. And then for supper, I have something going on in just a little bit that I need to, so I don't have time to cook. So I'm having a salad. It's just um, green leaf and romaine mixed together. There's green apple, Granny Smith apple, red onion, olives, avocado, and chicken. And then I made apple cider vinaigrette. I use the same recipe every time. It's like a quarter cup of the vinegar, any kind of vinegar except regular. Um, regular vinegar is not AIP compliant in elimination phase. Um, so any kind of vinegar, a fourth cup of, and then a about a half cup, I like to use a little less of oil. Um, so I use olive oil, of course. And then garlic, I just toss in a little bit. And a little bit of salt and a little bit of honey. Shake it up and you got a great vinaigrette. All right, so I'm gonna go eat because like I said, I have something going and I will check in with y'all tomorrow. Bye everyone, happy Friday Eve.